Oh, we made five of the seasoned sardines. Now we're just gonna go get the bucket and get the bucket of milk in my quest. And that is your third cat. Cooking experiment kit and chocolate summon stew. So we're a cat now. Let's go and roll a new thing. Completing this task. But it's 35% easy. Nice. You made a new one? Next one is get a new uniques from hard clue scroll. That is a medium task, so let's go and get a hard clue scroll because I don't have any. Me for the future here. I should mention that I discussed some stuff with my friend Yonti500 and we came to the conclusion that we should clump these unique tasks together so that I take less percentages on the task sheet. So that's why the current task says tree. And now, back to the video. Okay. Still grinding a few things here, but we did get a summon mask while my grinder did this grind on the phone, so that's why you didn't see anything of it. We eat everything in here, except that one's gonna go in there. Yeah, let's get some more lobster and go and kill some more giants. Oh, hey! That's the first Asian shard in a collecting log. Let's go. That's one reason why I'm here. Look at that. Both Asian shard and a clue scroll in the same drop. Let me drop these two and we're gonna increase the quality of both of them. Also playing Quizmaster on my other account. That should now give me a prayer level. Uh, turn on prayer. One more for overhead range protection. Two, finally, clue scroll. Fossil Island. Let's see how we can get there. Okay, to do this one, we need to finish the dig site and Fossil Island, which means we're gonna do those. Because why the hell not? For Bon Voyage, get access to the Fossil Island. I'm gonna start with the dig site. And I'll get you back when I've done that. Who can I turn this into? Okay, I guess I have to find a display cases. I will do that and I will return to you soon. Go. We go, a few of those. So we've got some more antique lamps and we've got some more kudos. We have 53. Now we're gonna go back in here. I'm gonna show this artifacts to one of the archaeologists. This same dude, why not? Take my art. Take my art. There. This one, right? Two. Eight. Thirty. Okay, that one already turned in. No, I can't have turned in the other. Other partially occupied. Okay, so let's go and dig some more finds. Try to find a potter. I can actually start Bone Voyage quest line. Indeed. Before that, we're going to go and turn in the rest of the stuff here. See if we can get more antique lamps. Two wooden stocks. Bowl and some bones. But yeah, nothing of value, unfortunately. 2500 crafting and 2500. Mining. Forty-four crafting. You can I make start a leather shop? Nice. Well done. You complete an easy task. That's not what I was supposed to do. There we go. Got the bone voyage quest. There we go. Let's actually go. I'll finish this and I'll get you all back. Herbal ore. I'm gonna experience there. I need 20 for this one. Uh, I guess room crafting then. Ah, oh, fletching. I need to get up fletching levels. 
and 19 herb lore. You can make, make Guamtari and you know, 25 fletching. You can make oak longbows. Fantastic. I'm gonna turn this all in and gear up for the quest. Hey, we did it. We're now in Fossil Islands. Let's go and actually do the clue step, shall we? Well, that didn't work at all. Apparently, it's only on text which mage if you're far away. This is fully. LA. Switch my gear up. Are you for real? Three health! The dude survived with like three fucking health! Just embarrassing. Awkward or difficult. There's a crazy near the clay golem in the ruins, sir. We can do that. Yeah, I'd start flinching and I still almost died. Fantastic. Just gonna hand this clue over to Butsum because I don't feel like doing red this side at all. Yeah, we need the lead clue and then we can get the boss clue. Yeah, let's go and farm another hut. Wilderness west of East and Green Dragons. Oof. Let's see. Probably gonna do it, but still sounds scary. Oh, I'm gonna run over there. Yeah, let's go and attempt doing this one. Oh. Okay. Well, I just got murdered. Hope he enjoyed his wild ashes, I suppose. Uh, apparently you can't use the Dark Altar, which I just learned. Could probably look it up, but I will. That is Holy Prayer. Holy Prayer putting us in a total of... Giving us range protection. Protects from missiles. Hopefully I can get 43 with what I have left. With a bit of luck. Also, the combat level 69. Nice. Available for two, by the way. Yeah, there we go. We still need 1900 for 43 prayer, unfortunately, but we're still gonna go attempt the Samurai King Wish though, because it should only deal magic damage, and we do have protection against magic. Well, let's go give it a shot. Yeah, looting bag. That's also fun. Yeah, let's go see if we can do this clue. Okay, uh, looking into this, this fairing does not technically require me to complete so I can do fairing travels at all. But this specific one is in the realms of realm of the Fisher King, which I need to partially complete the Holy Grail quest. So we are going to go first and do Merlin's Crystal and then we're going to do the Holy Grail quest. Well, I did a dire task on, well on the quest to get some beeswax just because, well... I wanted to pick some flax. There we go, that's Merlin's crystal completed. And... That's the Holy Grail started. Let's start doing that. Hey, mime boots and mime top. Two of them, even. Hey, random events. That's the mime event done, I believe. Let me see. Yes, I don't have to do any more mime events on this character. Heck yes! <laughs> this place doesn't look a lot cleaner. And final, actually, go over here. Dick. 
Find another clue. I go. I need to speak to the fairy queen. <laughs> okay. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start doing fairy tale quest because I need to get fairy tale two completed before I can even do this clue. This clue step to talk to the fairy queen. Okay. Supposedly does not acknowledge you first time meet her. But I'm gonna go with try anyway, so we're gonna start with Lost City. And there we go. Lost City quest completed. I'm just gonna quickly check if I can actually not finish the clue step. But Wiki says so, so probably not. Yeah. Unfortunately not. Cannot do that. Blue steps, let's continue with nature's spirit so we can start doing fair tale. That is nature's spirit done. Which means we can start fair tale part one. Don't mind me just standing on the queen target here. There we go, fair tale one completed. Got some magic secateurs for it. Let's see how else I'm gonna get the rest of the farming and herb lore experience needed to actually do the part two of this quest. I should might remember this cutscene because oh, I started a giant dwarf and then forgettable tales of a drunken dwarf for the farming experience. But I need to finish fishing contest for that. There we go, that's the giant dwarf completed us. Now we can start Tales of a Drunken Dwarf to get some more farm experience. There we go. That is fishing contest completed. Moving on to the forgettable tale forgettable tales. Forgettable tale of a drunken dwarf. That is your guessable tale of a drunken dwarf or whatever it's supposed to be. And some more farm experience. Putting us to 29 farming. Time to go do the god or reach a Frankenstein actually so we can do God of Tranquility. There we go. That's creature Frankenstein done. So now we can go and start God of Tranquility. Hey, and that is God of Tranquility completed. 5,000 experience and active. Cars and supreme super compost potions, some seeds. And to cast West Mines also. Which level? That's 33 farming. Ooh, that's so close. How much more experience do we need for 34? 700. So let's go and do some harvesting. There is a reason I bought the Graceful Cape. Most because I'm gonna get more runs done and all that. <laughs> because we're gonna go do tight farming real soon. Go recruitment drive for some herb lore. This is just a sidetrack as I'm waiting for some stuff to be ready for farming. So final farming level. Actually start doing some tight bar. I also might have mind that I failed one of these rooms. Or that. That's the first farming level from tight farming. Gonna get it a hold of the basic 20 by 20 planting and we should hopefully not be here for too long before we reach well, 49 farming. There we go. For first 35 points, I'm going to leave and go and harvest some Arlander seeds. Boom. 9,000 experience. Two bonus points. And I'm on farming level 42. 30. Go and harvest some more herbs. This shelf I need to search? Read diary. Oh, the shades of Morton. Yes. There we go. Okay, it's well done, my friend. And there it is. Shades of Morton completed. Crafting experience and herblore experience. 29 herblore. Fantastic. And now make energy mix. And 1075 total. You find the key. Contrition and gold coin. What is that? Magic stuff. And it does a swamp base at the bottom of the chest. No way. Let's open this one. There's some treasure. 
comes from taste. Hey, we used the keys at least, so let's go. Let's get the hell out of here. I don't like this place. Would you be up for doing helping with Hero's Quest? Oh, I have to go finish Dragon Slayer One though. So I guess we're gonna, I'm gonna go do Dragon Slayer One instead. Which Slayer Dragon? Yes, I have. I have its head here. I actually did it. I mean, you told me to. Underestimated your adventure. I apologize. You are a true hero, and I'm happy to sell your rune plate, buddy. And now I have all the recommendation requirements done. So now go and join the hero skill. Uh, might as well give him a few, a little cash. What? What do you mean? There's more? I'm oh, sorry, I just had a little fun with you. Just a little hair skilled humor here. What I really meant was, congratulations, you completed hair skill enter the crime man. Woohoo! Take this reward. Heck yeah, that's some experience. And I can now buy some axes and stuff. Turf the herb lore. Defense potions, you can now clean toad flax. That's, not that's the only level I got. This is gonna be what I'm gonna do for a few hours now. Making a few unfinished potions, grand exchange, selling them to get like double back and buying more grimy herbs. Grimy herbs. Quite a few I bought. Hope I will get that herbal level soon. Four at least. Making iron till tar. This is a relatively decent experience and it's quite cheap, all things considered. But yeah, at level 44, I'm gonna consider check out if I'm gonna change my method or if I'm just gonna buy a lot more of everything. And yeah, actually, do this to 57. I don't envy Iron Man or Ultimate Iron Man in this, in trading Herblor. Okay, I have officially. Both everything I need. Or set it up for something to buy it on the Grand Exchange. So now we just have to wait and we'll do that. Well, not, why not farm a bit more? Get some unicorns for that dust. Because there's a buy limit on Swamp Tar and I need 47,540. I've counted now. 47,580. And there's a buy limit on 30,000. Or 13,000, I will ask my friend. He bought some for me, and I'm also buying more now. And hopefully, I will get 47,000 before I run out of money. Yeah, now I just have to wait for some more until. Altar. 57 Herblor. <laughs> Means we can officially start Fairtale Part 2. And actually, you just hard clue. Side note. 53,000 mantle tar, which is gonna fuel our range the magic spares a bit. You get a salamander. Okay, while well, waiting for the quest to unlock, I have to wait for some plants to grow. A mystery box. Let's see what's inside. It's a book. Uh, earrings. What oh, is not enough? I still need to actually do. Finish this quest to be able to talk to the fair queen, so let's continue. Oh. As for Fairy Tales Part 2 completed, got some even experience. Can I have of Cavalier's Tomb is so far? Very well. No. Next quest, of course, a spade. It Next up is Dig Behind Yanil Bank. Very well, let's get a spade and go do that. I got the casket! Fuck yeah! Well, I think I'm gonna go back to Crate Current and get some, stack some more caskets. I think I'm gonna stack three before I open them. We'll get a bunch of... Unique. I didn't expect the hit point all, but that's flat 60 on that one. Right in that hard clue. Finally back on questing, doing the underground pass to get access to the 
accursed elven land. There's quite a few clue steps in it, and I want them all. That is underground pass done. I was way too nervous on how difficult it actually was. Yeah. The regicide. Yeah, I've been training some agility for this side. My heart closed step, but we are done with 51 because I can actually boost that with summer pies. I'm gonna do that instead. And buy some stuff. And there we go. Put the summer pies in this can be our gear to get through that underground pass. Let's go through that and finish this clue step. Oh, that's failed of underground pass because I ran out of rope, so now we're bringing five. No, if we don't fail again, it got through underground pass. Oh, I'm so happy. Hopefully, I will never have to go through that again. Hopefully, I think I'm gonna put it towards under. No, I'm gonna put it towards construction. I would like to get construction up to 10 at least. Yeah, feel nice with some books for lunch. I fucking died. Fuck this quest. Fuck it. Okay, so this is a way to actually deal with this mage. Hopefully I will kill him before my prayer runs out. Issue. Yeah, this is a safe spot for it. Hello over here. That's under 85 air rooms, that's actually really good. So yeah, some of you might know that I actually got in the third priest of Graceful now. So well, at the same time I got level 56 in agility. So yeah, that's my third piece. Closing in on that full Graceful. After the third wilderness in a wilderness step in a row, I got my caskets. Let's go home. It's nice to know that there's actually some very nice people around here as well. Now what is this? You might wonder, why am I do getting woodcutting level all of a sudden? Well, because I need to start the Legends quest. And I'm missing the crafting requirement. I need to be 50. Same with the woodcutting, also need to be 50. I'm also missing waterfall quest, which I'm about to do, and family quest quest. I can do both. Just chopping some wood in the meantime. We're gonna start this gnome spirit tree quest, or uh, what is it called? Tree gnome village. To be Tellward out of the maze, like that. There we go. We finished the waterfall quest. So we are now on one of the seven quest points we need for the quest. And yeah, I have to go do family quest. There we go, family quest completed, and one less grind for legends quest. Oh boy, my first forest event. How to get so anime infused bark? Oh, that's 50 fire making. We're practicing some wood cutting. Forest event was a bit tricky to figure, try to figure out in your first attempt, but. Right. And there we go, that's wood cutting complete. Um, get the Margaret and Jason Craft Cloud Buff. Go and train some magic. And there we go, the last requirement 56 magic after super hitting some orbs. Some orbs. Some material, some more iron. I care, but I should be able now to start the Legends quest. I need 50 crafting, so let's go and work on that crafting. There we go, 50 crafting, so now I can finally start Legends quest and actually go finish this clue step. There we go, a casket, and that should be our third one. We should... It's time to do an opening. This open these bad boys. And it's time to do an opening. Magic bow, I guess that's useful. Page collection slot, 
And purple sweets. Not a single unique. There we go. Ranged level 60. Now we're red dragon hide armor, dark bone, crossbow, and use dragon darts, dragon knives, and use toxic seal soul. That's going to be it for the episode of the task account. I'm ending it here because I'm quite tired of farming hard clue scrolls, and also my membership ran out, so I couldn't actually finish the task. But did finish a lot of other tasks while trying to get hard clue casket. These are my current stats and my current completion percentage on the task sheet. I don't know when I will start the task account again, but uh, but it will start again, so I'm having a lot of fun doing this. Until next time. See ya.